Hi, what's up y'all, it's Poppin' It's D, about to react to this video. Apparently, this body cam footage has been released of NBA Youngboy explaining how money Yaya stabbed uh, his girlfriend, or was it his other baby mama, something like that, I forgot what the situation is. He got too many women to keep up with. Um, But I remember Kodak saying that uh, NBA Youngboy snitched, that he snitched on Yaya. So we about to get the tea and see exactly what he said and if he was snitching. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let, let, let's watch. Oh, no, I'm saying she did it. It's officer. Get her. <laughs> no, I'm such on this girl. What he said? He's just when a girl grabbed the night kick her. Uh -huh. That's what I keep telling him, man. Like, my girl ain't doing anything wrong. The girl who got stabbed, she's going to tell you that she's going to stab. Like, she's going to try. Oh, okay. He's, he's not snitching. I have to take it back. Why were they running with that narrative? That oh, he snitched on Yaya. Yeah, yeah. Why were they running with that narrative? Why were they running with that narrative that, oh, he snitched, he snitched? Where did they get that from? I feel like there was a document or something that, I don't know. But, yeah, he, he's not snitching, apparently. Even though he lying. What? What did he say? The knife fell on her? <laughs> what bullshit lies this? That's what I keep telling him, man. Like, my girl ain't doing anything wrong. The girl who got stabbed, she gonna tell you that. Knife or name. It's just when the girl grabbed the knife, kick her. When a girl grabbed her, the knife hit her. How does a knife hit you? Why does she even have the knife in the first place? But go off. You you protect your then woman. By the way, this is one of my favorite accents. A Louisiana accent, I, I I like it. My hated accent is the Baltimore one and the Memphis one. Y'all can go to hell who have those strong accents. I'm sorry. If you out there and you got a real strong strong be more accent or a, or a Memphis accent, go to hell and never talk to me. Oh, it's so ugly. Oh, y'all accents are ugly. <laughs> I'm going to say Memphis is top one. That is the ugliest accent I heard in my life. Glorilla, I, oh, I cringe when I hear her talk. Her, or what's that other one? Uh, Moneybag, yo, oh, oh, it's so ugly. This one I like, though. Speak up, niggas. She never was in a bad job, right? So that's what he said. Man, tell me why I was looking for this girl the whole time. She was in his car. He did say she was in the car. You my security. You my security. He also said that she got out. And she got out. I didn't woke up by then. When I walk outside, she on my front porch. She asked for a phone. I walk inside to get a phone. When I come back, she's sitting right there. Nah, get the fuck out. Which one is that, though? Short one, man. The little short light skin one? Yeah, I had a fight. I had a fight. Okay, okay, okay. That's what I'm saying. So that's what I'm trying to say. So maybe no, that's the one you said get out, right? That's the one you ain't want in the house, right? The yeah, that's the one you ain't want in the house. And that's the one, and then that's the one when you woke up, she was in the house. Yeah. And she's supposed to be outside the house. Okay. Yeah. What's all these boxes? This is so low, y'all. Jesus Christ. Do I have to do another one of these? And this one's for the nice. She yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she did. Come on, man. That makes sense. 
Because no, it wasn't no, it wasn't no big ass puncture wound on it. So yes, it was. And why, the, why the wound, why the wound look like that? It's because I like she tried to, you know, grab a hard. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. She ain't grabbing no soap. Yeah, yeah. Like, 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 I ain't gonna lie, my cousin dead, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I thought when I, I ain't gonna lie, she she was badly fucking moving. This cop is ghetto. Clean up this room. Some viewers may find this. <laughs> Wait, we got more tea. Apparently, there's a Yaya video as well, and she's getting interrogated. Let's hear what what she has to say. It says she's interrogated after stabbing NBA young boy side chick. That was his side chick. Jesus Christ, let's watch. Hi, you know, I'm Deputy Malik with the constables. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, all right, I'm gonna read these instructions to you. Okay. So every time I ask you if you understand, you need to tell me if you understand or not. Okay? Just okay, calm down, no. just instructions, and then we're gonna start some questioning. Uh, for now, I'm not, I, I don't know. They just took her to the hospital. I hope she's okay, okay? So, uh. Stab us by the next night. Is they okay as well? You stab them. I'm, here, I'm not going anywhere. Man, right now, we don't know. Well, right, that's what we're trying to ask. So just give me a few minutes, okay? Okay, so I'm going to uh, read these instructions to you, okay? You have the right to remain silent and not make any statement at all. And any statement you make may be used against you at your trial. Do you understand? Yes. Any statement you make may be used as evidence against you in court. Do you understand? Yes. You have the right to have a lawyer present to advise you prior to and during any questioning. Do you understand? Yes. If you are unable to employ a lawyer, you have the right to be, have a lawyer appointed to advise you prior to and during any questioning. Do you understand? Can you repeat it again? If you are unable to employ a lawyer, you have the right to have a lawyer appointed to advise you prior to any, during any questioning. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Yes. You have the right to terminate this interview at any point. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, are you willing to talk to us and tell us what happened? No. Can you state your name for record? Ayana. Loudly, please. Ayana. Last name? Mayweather. Okay, what's your date of birth? 
Okay. You want to tell us uh, what happened exactly today? Um, so, um, me and my fiance. What's his name? Kishan. Okay. We had, um, gotten to an argument, and, um, he told me to leave the house. And so, I left, and then I left and went for a walk, but I left my phone here. So then I came back to get my phone, and then I was still trying to stay at the house. And... Um, he was he was telling me to leave, okay. and then I didn't know it was a girl here. She came down to fight me, and we had like started fighting or whatever. And I just like I ran and I uh, I ran and I grabbed knives out the kitchen, mm -hmm. and all I remember is like her pulling my hair, and I just like when she was pulling my hair, she put my head down, and I just like swung at the knives and I like, yeah, and so I and she I was upstairs. Huh? So she was upstairs when you came. She was. Yeah, when I came in the house, she was upstairs, but then she came downstairs. She came down? Yeah. Okay, and what did she say when she came down? Um, telling me to get out of the house. She stopped telling you to get out of the house? Yeah. Okay, and what did you do? Um, I, I told her that I didn't have, like, he's my fiance, I don't have to leave the house. Okay. And then, um, that's when, like, she started, um, she tried fighting me or whatever, and then that's I mean, when what, what exactly she did? Um. Take your time. But um, Did she that's, that's when my lip was busted. Okay. We had started, we had, we had started fighting, and then so I had, uh, I had like got away from her. And I went and I grabbed, I, I grabbed two knives, and then um, she had like came back towards me, and she was like, like at first I was like running like away from her with the knives, and then she had like pulled my hair, like my hair back. And then all I remember is I just pulled my head back, my head came back down, and then I just like swung the knife to my hit her. Okay. And, and how did you got your lip busted? Um, she bit me. At what, I mean, what point did she hit you on your face? When we first started fighting. So when she approached you, uh, you guys were having a verbal argument, and then she started chasing you, or no, she, she punched you, but... She came, she, she came, she, um, we just like... Like she came downstairs and like she told me to get out and she started. Like, she told you to get out of the house. Yeah. Okay. And did she touch you at that point? Yes. What did she do? She hit me. She hit you how? Um, in my face. She punched you. Yeah. With your right hand or left hand? I don't remember. You don't remember? Okay. And was he? Was your was your fiance? Was he there? Yeah. At the whole point. At the whole time he was there. Um, not the um, not the whole time, but when like he heard us. He wasn't there the whole time, but when he, well, he was inside the whole time, but, um, he, he didn't, when, when he started, um, fighting, he came to, like, break up the, like, came to break up the fight. Was he, was he there from, when she came down, was he down here with you as well, as well? He was, no, he was in the, um, in the master bedroom. I don't know what he was doing when he had came out, and that's when he tried to break up the fight. So, were you guys shouting when you guys were fighting? So did he hear the shouting? Did he, did he come out at that point? So as soon as she came down, she started shouting on you, he came out as well? Um, yeah, I guess like he came out when she came. Okay, so uh, she approached you and then what? She, she hit you on your face or what? I told you, yes. And then what? And then after, so she, so she came down, she telling me to get out of the house. Was it as like a slab? Was it an open fist? Yeah, she punched me. That's why she punched you? Yeah. Okay. And so, uh, we, like we were fighting. Like after she hit me, we had started fighting. And, then and where was this when you, when you guys like, started? By the, like right, like, like between the stairs and the kitchen. And then I had ran, I had got away, like I had got away from her when we were fighting. And I grabbed knives and then she was still telling me to get out. And I was telling her, no, I'm not getting out. And that's when she pulled my hair back. And I, and I remember her pulling my hair back. And I came forward and I had my head like this and I just swung with the knife to my head and I hit it. So well, she was chasing you in the kitchen? Before. She chased me through the kitchen to, to, the living, to the living room is where she pulled my hair and I pulled my head down and I hit it. Okay, and how, how you guys ended up to the main gate? The main gate? 
Yeah. Where? That's where she was lying down. Oh, um, she, um, she had walked, like she, her arm was bleeding, and so she had like walked over there, and my fiance was helping her, and then I came outside and I called 911. You called 911? Yeah. Okay. So apart from punching on your face, did she hurt you? Um, I don't know if I have the. Like, uh, she, she pulled your hair and she yeah. punched you and that's it? Yeah, I don't know if I have um, any more bruises in there, but that's it. Okay. And I have a few, I have a few scratches on my wrist and I have a scratch on my forehead. Okay. And did you, did you uh, swung with both knives or one knife? Um, I don't remember. I just remember putting my head down and I just like, swung my hand. So but you had two knives know, in your hand? Yeah, but I don't know, like, if both knives hit her or just one? Okay, so you had a knife in every, each hand? Yeah, both of them. Okay. So the whole reason was just because she was asking you to leave the house? Well, she was trying to put me out of my fiance's house here. Right, okay. Okay. And I, I don't know her either. You don't know her? I don't know her. I never. Is this the first time you see her? Yeah, yeah. I never seen her again. Okay. And do you live here or? Now, where do you live? I go back and forth between here and Vegas. Vegas, okay. All right. Give me a minute. Sorry, I was quiet this whole time because I was like then, okay? I was paying attention. When I'm really paying attention to some shit, I'm very quiet because I'm paying attention. Whenever I'm running my mouth and talking through reactions, I, I'm not really paying that much attention. <laughs> I'm just talking shit with y'all, you know, trying to be engaging because y'all watching me and, you know, it's required for these type of reaction videos. But when I'm locked in and paying attention, I get very quiet. Um, This is wild though. Imagine doing all this over a, a dude. Like, girl, girl, this is embarrassing but sure you know she's no longer with him and now she got a baby with him just just embarrassing you didn't stab this woman but her the other chick the side chick coming downstairs to fight her just the, the ratchet behavior ratchet ratchet behavior but am i surprised nba young boy is a ratchet himself he got 50 kids and, and all his baby mamas is ratchet as hell this is just sad y'all let me know what y'all think though let me know what other videos you're gonna watch and i'll see y'all the next time Bye.